I'm gonna tell the story of the song, but I don't want to tell it if nobody understands what I'm talking So this is the story of uh, a friend of mine's wedding from five years ago in upstate New York. I was invited, but I was one of the last people invited, so I was kind of at the last table. I didn't know these people very well. I don't know their family history. And um, halfway through the reception, this guy gets up and gives this pretty amazing toast that uh, there was a lot of very boring toasts, and then this guy gave up, got up and gave this like really gripping, sad, emotional toast, and he was crying, and he sang the song Wild Mountain Time that I've always loved. And um, it really stuck with me, and I was like thinking how much I love this guy and how much I was going to applaud when he finished speaking, and then he stopped talking, and uh, he was immediately escorted out, and I realized that I was the only one in the entire place who was gripped by this guy's story because everybody else hated this guy. <laughs> and it turned out he was the father of the bride, and he wasn't invited, and he wasn't wanted, and nobody else cared a shit about his toast, and all they wanted was for him to leave. I wrote the song from his perspective about how the day's events went down. It's called The Bride's Dad. <clears throat> One, two, three. My ginger voice was raw as smoke. They hid their smiles when I stood and spoke. Some sunny lawn, some Saturday. My face was flushed when I went to see Wild Mountain Time. But I was crying before the second night. The strawberry stripes across my ruddy cheeks got them giggling. My eyes were red and wild and wide as I choked up over another life. For years and years I disappeared. Tonight I'm here and I'm giving my best. It's all. called uh, When the Truth Is. So it's you and me.